Hello, it's Emma Jo here from Lavinia Stamps and today I will be showing you how to make this a rather gorgeous large tag and it's got some seasonal words on there, sticker and some embossing and a little bit of stencil work and I think it's just vivid and rather lush. Anyway, enough chat from me, let's go and see how it's done. Right, so we're going to start with creating the background. And for this, I've got that large watercolour card tag and I've just used some acrylic spray sun yellow. What's coming next, I hear you say? Well, that's cranberry red, the acrylic spray. And I'm just going to dry that off. Oh, a little bit of an out of focus bit. Oh, it's stencil time. Magic. So that was the dynamic stencil. And I've got my size nine stencil brush and Elements Ink Henna. I'm just pushing that through the stencil gently with my brush in twirly circles. And look at that. I've only done it on the right hand side, really. Started at the top and did a nice drape over. So now we're going to get onto the Winterberry stamp and pop it on an acrylic block. And we're going to use some Versamark. And just stamp us some berries. And again, I'm using the Wow Embossing Powder Rich Metallic Gold or Metallic Gold Rich or Gold Metallic Rich, one of them. And there you go. And I've just popped it on, tapped it off and heated it up until it's snapped to. Got erratic hands today, haven't I? I'm so sorry. There we go. Can you see? It's catching the light. It's lovely. And now I've gone on to the larger of the two stamps. Inked it up with Versamark. Used some of the embossing powder I've already got on my sheet down there. And I'm just drying that now. And I love it. As it dries, it will... It's almost like it snaps to, like iron filings on a magnet. Stands to attention and suddenly becomes this metallic, beautiful berry. Now, obviously, you can do as many or as few of these berries as you would like. But what I'm doing is I've got the stencil going from top left down to bottom right and the berries going from bottom left towards top right. So crack open the Posca pens, we're going in and we've got Posca pen green. And this is the sparkly green. This is Posca orange. And I'm just giving those berries, those traditional colours of red, orange and green. It's a lovely plant. I don't know its name, but you can buy them around Christmas in the UK. They sort of look like mini... Oh, that's the sparkly yellow. I love that. And that's the not sparkly yellow. That's the normal yellow. Posca pens are amazing for just adding that little bit of colour. And so I'm just going to highlight the side of this berry stamp with the white Posca. Give it a little couple of dots on the berry itself. And 
And you know what I'm like with dots. I'm going back in. I think this tag just screams celebration. So I'm playing with the dots that already exist in the dynamic stencil and adding a few of my white dots to echo that pattern. And take our line of vision upwards. Love it. And to make certain sure that that rose hip is going to stand out, I've got my purple or lavender pen, Posca, to add another little bit of zing. But you can use the stamp, the embossing, to just be your guide here. So don't stress, I'm not asking you to draw freehand. I'm just asking you. No, I'm not asking you to do anything. <laughs> it's up to you. But, you know, it's there. Use it. It's a guide. And now, what's this, I hear you say? Well, it's dark denim. That's what it is, Elements Ink Dark Denim and a size 9 stencil brush. And we're just going to liven up the edges, or in this case, darken up the edges. But look at that. It's just got a lovely little... It, it just gives it a frame, doesn't it? And here we go. Sentiment sticker set to, and I've gone with Blessings. And I'm adding a little bit, just from the leftover ink that I've got on my brush and this is lime green stickles. I love these for just adding a subtle touch of glitter. So hopefully by the end of this, this will have that soft sheen of the embossing powder and also that bling from the stickles. And you did it! Hurrah! Well done! Do you know what? I do like this tag. It's, it just screams celebration, which is fabulous. It's got everything that you could possibly want to use to make a tag on there. We've got embossing. What else have we got? We've got acrylic sprays. We've got stickles. We've got the seasonal word stickers. And Posca, of course we've got Posca, um, but you know what we haven't got? Teal, <laughs> which is probably a good thing because everybody needs a break every now and again. So I hope you've enjoyed yourself. Thank you very much for coming along and having a go with me at making this tag. I hope you've enjoyed yourself. If you've got any comments you'd like to make about this craft, please pop them in the post below and I will do my best to get back in touch with you as soon as I can. In the meantime, though, Happy crafting!